Right, let me start by welcoming you to the very first video brought to you from our new studio, which you'll be seeing plenty more of in the months ahead, and we have some exciting new developments to share with you all pretty soon. But for now, we're looking at a new release from TaylorMade. And in today's video, something very unusual happens, not once, but twice, so make sure you don't go anywhere. Now, when we talk about wedges, the first thing that comes to most golfers' minds is spin. In fact, most of us only consider changing our wedges when we think we're losing spin due to the age of club. Am I right? Now, my opinion on how much an average golfer actually benefits from that spin is, well, that's debatable, but that's for another video. See, today sees the launch of the new TaylorMade Hito 3 wedges with raw face and micro rib face. So a reminder first of all of what raw face actually does. It creates a groove that sits on the limits in terms of legality and then no plating is added, so effectively it gives you the most control and spin possible. These new wedges have an interesting sole design which is a four-way camber. The trail edge camber, leading edge relief and the wider sole make this a very versatile set of wedges. And versatility is the key with these Hito 3 and this could lead to keeping money in your pocket. Now I'll explain later where that money saving and the thought process comes from. But right now I've been playing these wedges for three rounds and you'll see a number of shots played with both the 54 and the 58. Now one is mainly flighted higher than the other, but then it's quite easy to deal off the 58 and open up the 54 to play a number of different shots with each. And you see the four-way camber allows that versatility in the wedges and this is why I could feel you could save money by gaming these wedges. But before we discuss that idea, let's take a closer look at the Hito 3 wedges and as you can see they are in fact the cavity back wedge. The Hito shape effectively provides spin from more of the club face. So when you lay the face open or bunker shots for example where the club generally slides under and across the ball and having contact with that high toe area. So all that kind of makes sense to me. Now I did find these wedges very playable and the versatility was evident as you can see. I played the high shots with the 54, but I could still play low spinners with the 58. So able to swap between the two clubs and play the same type of shot was really positive. And the only negativity I would see is possibly the color, this bronze look, it could put many off who prefer the kind of more traditional look. Now onto where money can be saved, the four-way camber is key on that basis because you can manipulate the face and effectively add loft or de-loft and effectively the 54 and the 58 wedges just become one. So for many of you that like to carry maybe up to three wedges, a 50, a 54 and a 58 being a typical set, in my opinion you can eliminate one of those wedges from your bag. Now this 54 degree must be my lucky wedge because I did say this happened not once but twice. Yes, I managed to chip in from off the green, something I've not done for many, many rounds. Now overall a great set of wedges from Taylor made, adding to the huge choice that you have out there right now. So let me know what your thoughts are. If you're ready for new wedges, are these on the list or is that bronze colour too off-putting? And finally, all I've got to say is thanks for watching in what has been, like I said, our very first video shot in this new studio. And I will also repeat the fact that we've got some interesting stuff to announce very soon. You'll be seeing more of this studio and another new setup that we've been working on in the last few months. And I can't wait to share this whole thing with you in a, uh, well, with a better explanation than we would have been able to give you in today's video. Anyway, today's all about those Hito 3 wedges. Let me know what you think, like, subscribe, and I'll see you all soon.